I was looking at that cloud of smoke and I said, that's almost right where my house is at. I called my mom and they got a reverse 911 call. And they said, you have two minutes to evacuate from your home. My dad said that when he was grabbing the last couple of things, he could see the fire reaching the back fence of our house. For the public, it is chaos. They're trying to evacuate. They're trying to think about the things that they had never considered before. What do I want to take out of my home if I only have a few minutes? Where are my children? How am I going to communicate to my wife or husband who's at work? All the things that you should be prepared for prior to an emergency, they're now trying to make a decision in a split second. I was just picturing that my dad would arrive with all sorts of crazy tables and weird things sticking out of the back of the truck. And when they pulled up, I looked in the back and I just saw a couple boxes and our two dogs. Everything was gone. When a fire destroys a home, it's a significant emotional event. Their entire life may be down to one piece of memory that they're able to sift through the rubble. When you call 911, we are there to provide you care, but what we need you to do is to be able to help yourself. Sit down with your family over dinner. Talk about what you would do in an emergency. Have an evacuation plan. If you're trying to prepare while the emergency is going on, you're too late. 